topic because zero was about what what type of well, if there was a particular type of HHO device that you favor above others. So zero, here's your answer to your question. Yep. Well, finally somebody got it right. This is the title of my topic. And uh, this company, uh, I'll tell you why, I travelled, I've seen companies waste tens of millions of dollars and not get it right on HHO. I've tested many cells. I've seen dozens of cells. I've seen results around them, you know. And I've talked to some good people, but I ran into this two people. In fact, we tested their system this week. And they had a system. We, we, we'd commissioned another system to get some gas out and their system like was producing six lead in it at 72 amps at 13 or 12 Whoa. volts. The other system we'd bought, it was chewing 112 amps. And I looked at this and they got everything right. Now, there's more to a cell than just bolting a few plates, what people call the dry cell. You know, the one you have a plate, a seal, a plate, a plate, you bolt, bolt them all together. But if you just do that, you run into some problems. One is uh, they often chew up, if they're not done properly, they chew up too much energy, they blow PWMs to the devices that sort of keep them cool they, and chop the current. They have uneven gas flow. First thing I test, you know, get a little bow meter and see if the gas flow is even. They dry out the gas and it's all to do that. These people, it's a husband and wife and she's the first lady I've ever met who knows technically as much as anybody I've ever met with about HHO helps run the business. Unfortunately, she doesn't have a sister. I found that out, so I'm out of luck again. But uh, Scott and Jen, and they're from a company called Central Valley HHO. And if you want to see a really good cell, I think they've got a website. You know, I'd go sell the systems direct, but they can soon tell you where you can get them. They're not cheap, but they're quality. What they did right was first, they understand the metallurgy. They bought their metals from overseas and they've got, well, bad for America, but they've got really good metal. They've got brilliant seals. They've got a mechanism so the plates will never leak. The PWM is perfectly matched to the cell and they can do variable gas throws on the fly. And I've seen data. I'm one for science and data, Gary. I'm a boring old fart. But I need to see, I've seen data logging for signals from them, and I know when we put their system on, I was getting the best results I ever got from any system I've ever tested. And we're using multi-million dollar cells and labs to do this. So it was really funny, the only reason, I, I never recommend a product, okay? But when you travel for years, you see titanium cells, you see glass jars with two bolts in, you see, oh, I've seen just about everything. Finally, somebody got it right and I love their cell. The biggest secret they got is their manifold design. So rather than bolt, bolt, plates, bolts, seals, bolts, a whole series of plates, they have a manifold, specially designed manifold in the middle. Uh, and that is the core to the secret of why they're getting good gas flow and everything else that it's doing good. And I've never seen that before. So they really spent years. The other thing I like about it is Look, I've seen very big, large corporations going to HHO business. With one friend telling me they had to replace it eight times. <laughs> one <laughs> unit. <laughs> eight times it broke down. These things, they've ever had a uh, PWM file or the actual cell file in the field. They've had a couple of things gone wrong, but they've learned how to fix them. More importantly, they're continuously developing. So they now know how to do the variable gas, you know, map it to the engine. They know how to do these things. And I don't often get excited about this stuff. I normally go to sleep. But as soon as I met them, two of the best people I've met, just good people, and they know their stuff, and they're all about doing the right thing. You know, rather than growing to a huge big corporation straight away, they've just focused on developing a quality product. So there's dry cells. That's my favourite. And this one is a dry cell, but with a lot of differences. And, uh, you know, I don't often plug stuff, but hell, this thing really set me back in my tracks. I thought, wow. So uh, I shouldn't plug, I guess, stuff, but they've done this right. And I'm talking about, let's say, 150 cells I've seen. They've done it right. And right, there's only now, about now, three now, fess up. How much of a commission are they giving you? I get nothing from them. <laughs> Actually, I get nothing from them. In fact, uh, 
Um, I don't ask for donations or take money. But somebody, I think after your last show, I had a lot of emails requesting me to do a website. So I'm actually paying their daughter to construct a website oh, no. for me. <laughs> <laughs> Darth Danzy and... Uh, DarthDanzy.com. Huh? <laughs> yeah, so you can, uh, I said uh, you can keep the uh, advertising revenue. I'll just do a blog. I haven't got time to do, uh, you know, build a web page. To be honest with you, that's all I've I don't, get, I don't, I don't get commission, but... Very, normally, 90% of the time, I'm an asshole. You know, I'm just telling people how bad their stuff is. This one, you know, you go, I normally walk and go, that's crap, that's crap, that's crap. Because uh, that's my job, to find out all the faults. I'm not saying they got perfection. There are three or four other companies I know that produce really good sales as well. And there's some very knowledgeable ones out there. Unfortunately, in the industry, and that's why they got banned in Germany, there's a lot of junk out there. You know, I've heard of cells exploding, taking toolboxes across freeways. I've, one lady uh, talked to me about four years ago. Hers blew up in a van. It was inside a van in the cargo area and sprayed them all with uh, all the shrapnel. Um, there's some very, very dangerous stuff out there. And there are some good systems. This isn't the only company, but one is the one that goes to the top of my list for two reasons. Really good people, very dedicated, and the cell was absolutely flawlessly. I've been running one for a month, actually. Uh, we threw the other one away and <laughs> kept this one and said, send us another one. So they did because we're pumping some pretty big volumes of gas in just to see what it does. One, uh, one interesting question. There, there, is, uh, there are some commercial uh, HHO welding machines.